my mother had a terrible time. And uh, you said there was eight, eight of your kids then. Eight of us kids. Oh boy. And uh, of course we lost the farm. And, and uh, after a year or two, we walked about uh, two and a half miles to school. And uh, we carried our. Uh, well, we got relief from uh, in uh, Worston County. And we got dried prunes, and dried apricots, and dried milk, and uh, probably uh, flour and rice and stuff like that. And uh, we was very, very poor. And, And uh, that's about all my background. Mm -hmm. And then further on. Uh, well, after your father died, then where did, did you guys move into town, or where did you? We where? moved into to Sterling. And you grew up there in Sterling then? I was farmed out. Uh, uh, I stayed with my uncle a couple of years going to school. And uh, <clears throat> then when I was in. And uh, I, I just worked on a farm. When I was uh, uh, about 12, 13 years old, I drove four head horses on a cultivator. And, uh, and uh, then when <coughs> the tractors come, I, was, I worked from daylight till dark, and I'd get in at night. And I, I've just farmed out to all farmers. Anybody that had me, that's where I'd go. Mm. And uh, so finally, uh, you know, you can't think of everything. You but, sure? Uh, but finally, uh, I finally graduated from, uh, in Sterling. We moved to Sterling. And, of course, we was on relief land. Uh, of course, everybody, we had corduroys and everything. Everybody knew that, that we didn't have any money. Anybody that wore corduroys, they got them from the uh, welfare. Mm -hmm. But in them days, you did, a welfare was welfare. You didn't get money. Right. You got relief. That was it. And so, <clears throat> and after the eighth, Eighth grade, I went one year of high school, and uh, I dropped out. You know, worked on the farm till I till I joined the navy. One head, of, 